It's a sad situation, in my view, when someone like Nipsey Hussle was shot down in his community in front of his store. I did not know him, but it deeply affected my heart. You know, when you hear of someone so young, so talented, and so caring in the community, and then someone from his own hood, from his own gang, to murder him. I know that it's more to it than just jealousy. Jealousy may pay a part as the, as the reason as to why he was the one that was chosen to do the assassin, assassination, in my opinion, allegedly. However, it's bigger than that. I know that it's enough that's going around about the property, the value, that there was a lot of money, billions of dollars involved. He was sitting on a gold mine. And it's not unreasonable, not unreasonable to think that he was assassinated. And someone with the mental factors as Eric Holder, allegedly, would be the perfect person to do the assassination. However, I don't think that he believed that he would ever be arrested because I believe, I believe in my opinion, allegedly, that he was told that he would be taken care of. And I believe that more people in the community, even in his own gang, are associated. I believe the, uh, that the government was, is associated. I believe there's a whole lot of people, the land development people, a whole lot of people. More than just Eric Holder. He was just a foul guy. He was just the one who they knew had the mental capacity to kill him. He's a, he was a shooter from my understanding, allegedly. I have a lot of information I am putting together. I want to be one of the ones that make sure that justice is for, done for Nipsey because he deserved justice. His family deserved justice. His children deserve justice. Imagine, Lil Cross, he's so young, he won't remember his daddy. However, his, his daughter will because she's old enough to remember. She's old enough that she's going to know, remember exactly how her father died. And I just thank God for the time that she did have with him. And it just saddens in my heart that this young man's life was taken for nothing. For nothing. But as the Bible says, the love of money is the root of all evil. As I said, as the Bible says, the love of money is the root to all evil. And I believe that to be true. It 